The RB Secret Sandwich, the Meat Mountain, gets an upgrade. Oh boy. Dirty Joe back at Arby's about to conquer the new Meat Mountain, Dolly style. Also has fish on it. Remember our web show where I had it before? Let's see how good it is with fish on it. Still 10 bucks. Let's give it a try. The Arby's Meat Mountain. Now it's a secret sandwich, not on the menu board, but if you walk up to the register and ask for it, they'll give it to you. And for $10, you get a sandwich with every piece of meat available in an Arby's restaurant. So what's on this Meat Mountain? It includes two chicken tenders, 1.5 ounce of roast turkey, 1.5 ounce pit smoked ham, one slice of Swiss cheese, 1.5 ounce of corned beef, 1.5 ounce of smoked brisket, 1.5 ounce of Angus steak, one slice of cheddar cheese, 1.5 ounce of roast beef, and three strips of bacon. But now the new addition making it Denali style by adding one Pollock fish filet. Now Denali is a reference to the highest mountain in Alaska. Now that's where Arby's gets their wild caught Pollock from. But with the addition of the fish, it's only available for a limited time. Now Arby's has added seafood to the menu for Catholics during Lent, but if they eat this on a Friday, it's a sin. Adding fish to the sandwich gives it a really crazy flavor. You got yourself surf, you got yourself turf, you can taste the bacon, then you get a little touch of roast beef, and then finally you get a touch of seafood. You would think it'd be crazy all these flavors together, but it actually works. It's like having a whole plate from a buffet. Remember what I told you before though, you definitely need to get yourself a packet of Arby sauce. All this meat on there makes the sandwich incredibly dry, but add a little Arby sauce, boom, it's perfect, you're good to go. Now I have no shame as people sat there in the restaurant staring at me eating this giant sandwich. I mean, you have to hold it with two hands. The only whammy though, you gotta eat it fast because eventually it starts to fall apart. Ooh. Some friends of mine have seen how I can destroy a Permanti Brothers sandwich, so you can only imagine what I did to this thing. This is quite a fiasco. What a mess. All right, we're not counting calories here, by the way. You know this thing is not for your diet. So when Arby says we have the meats, boy, this sandwich proves they mean it. So by adding the fish, you could say that Arby's Meat Mountain gets a big brother. All right, now it's no secret that Arby's is my favorite restaurant. You see it on my blogs, you see it on my tweets. I'm so excited when they try crazy sandwiches like this. Very succulent. Well, that's that. Meat Mountain, good value. Jersey Joe here, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, I hope.